what first drew you to the wolves? What was your first interaction with the play? What was that experience like? Um, I can speak to that. <laughs> um, I was at NYU um, with Susanna and Brenna, and I was working administratively in the office until I graduated. And um, the director of Playwrights Horizons Theater School was always very busy. And she was like, we have this play and Club Thumbs office is down the hallway and they have this play with these nine girls and they need to hear it out loud. Like, can you just pick eight of your friends and just see if they're free to read it next week? I was like, sure. I didn't know what it was about. I didn't read it. I, I, and I called Susanna, I called Brenna, I called a couple other young people we went to NYU with um, and we just read it on our spring break. And like, there were a couple of people that like chose to go on spring break instead, which was tough. Um, <laughs> but um, that I just like to, I love sharing that. Honestly, I do because it's, it is um, really indicative of how this entire world works of like, sometimes you're walking down a hallway and someone's like, wanna read this play. And then five years later you're doing, or a five years later panel about all of it. So that was my first interaction. And I, I think of it fondly. My first interaction, I'll just share this story very quickly. And it's just, Jenny, you reminded me of it. Yeah, this was 2015. So yeah. we all mm -hmm. met in 2016. This was 2015. And I remember reading the play before and going to the first kind of like read through workshop of it. And I was like, well, I'm, I, there's no one I'm playing other than number seven, but we weren't cast. We just kind of feel like, oh, you arbitrarily over there, you're number 46, you try out number 25. Oh. And I was like, I'm number seven. <laughs> and so I showed up wearing black lipstick and like tight pants and like boots as if that would like get in their brain saying cast me as number seven and it worked starting in 2015. <laughs> uh, and I want to be clear that when I showed up I had not read the play even a little bit at all had no idea like probably rolled out of bed straight to the reading and Jenna was like what did you think of the play and I was like I don't know um and then it ended up being the next four right. years of my life and my yeah. career as an actor has been possible because of it and um yeah you never know you just never know. I remember reading it for the first time. I got yeah. an audition for it and I opened the play and was like, how do you even read this play? There are three conversations going on at the same time. But I remember reading it and being like, wow, this is amazing. And I'm going to be in this. I felt this like cosmic sensation it was like, well, I'll be doing this and I will be playing number 46. And then I did. Oh my God. It was weird. When you know, you know. <laughs> 